How many people lived in Kinlock when you grew up here? When I grew up in Kinlock, it was thousands. I think at the highest point, if I'm not mistaken, I think it was about eight to 10,000. And it was a little 1.1 square miles. And how many is it now? Probably right at four or 500. Well, since they bought the uh, uh, bull hands out, it's probably less than that now. Kinlock City Hall and Police Station. Trash everywhere. And this all used to be buildings. Houses, houses, all of this. When it comes to poor black folks, St. Louis County do, do not care. They don't care. This side and all the way down to Martin Luther King, this is, this is all through Kenlock that they didn't bought out and just left stuff here. Just this. left it here. Who, who wrecked uh, the the boulders? Who, who, how, where did those come from? North Park, these, these foundations that they dug up. These are the foundations when, uh, uh, that they dug up about two years ago. Business still open right here? No, no, that's closed. I, I don't know if they're going to open it back up or not, but it has been closed. Man, we had everything out here. We had a library out here. We had funeral homes. We had everything. Everything that a, a, a city could have except a bank like this man so we still live in this one yes yeah, somebody stay in that one they so this just, this is where everybody used to live right this right. used to be this, the big housing this, project yeah, this is the uh gateway park apartments how many people used to live here i think it was 108 units and they're all empty now every last one of them. every last one of them now this is berkeley and look at us Look at us. Look at this shit here. <laughs> and now our board is right up here on 5th. And we have the south side of the street up here on 5th. I'll take you, so yeah, I, this I'll is take the city you. limit right here? Right, 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 right. House, houses on one side, right. rubble, <laughs> rubble on the other. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see exactly. How, when did this burn down? Oh shit, that been burning, man, for the last last two years two and a half years man been, been burning like several times yeah 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 yeah. would people come and just set a fire for fun yeah. what don't have shit to do at one time the police the cotton club saying. is the cotton club still open yeah that's the cotton club too that's still open oh the kinlock coffee shop yep that's they don't show nothing positive like that you see what i'm saying this goes to be the kinlock uh, um what they calling it, uh, historical district. Mm -hmm. You know, all they know how it's gonna be down through here and shit. You know, this is the historical district. They when they get when it's all when it's all said and done because they get <laughs> look like you were over in Bosnia or some fucking where, some war torn ass country. Yeah, that's exactly what it looks like. War zone. Yeah. About what year did it start to get like this? Uh, it started getting worse, bad in about uh, uh, 90, 98, when, when, uh, uh, when Keith became the man. And you know why? Because we had some more Uncle Tom shoe shuffling, step and fetch it, as Negroes was selling out. Hmm. Then we had a young man in here that wanted to fight for it, because he, he, they were thinking like I was thinking, a lot of us were thinking. You know, what about our kids? Mm. You know, where's our kids? What we gonna show our kids and shit, you know, where we grew up at? And they start fighting their ass. And then that's what said, okay, we gonna kick these Negroes in the ass every chance we get. Mm. And I'll be damned if they ain't held up to their word.